Good morning, Lions. Today is Friday, January 17th. You're watching Liberty Live. I'm Allison Rosowski. And I am Mr. Noble. Let's see what's trending in the news today. Allie, you got your, uh, your Twitter device on you? I, yes, All I right. do have my Twitter device on me. So now let's see, what do we got? Um, Eminem dropped a surprise new album. Eminem! Yeah. Woo! That's awesome. I should probably should listen to that. I heard that it's good. <laughs> I'm sure. Go ahead. What and do you got? now for today's science facts of the day. The world's largest amphibian in the giant uh, is the giant salamander. It can grow up to five feet in length. That is a big lizard. Yes. Very big lizard. Very big. Um, how else is you too? Oh, seniors, please keep your guidance counselor informed of any college decisions you have been receiving. All right, all juniors interested in applying for Rho Kappa Kappa Social Studies Honor Society candidate application packets are available in the JLHS homepage. Must be completed by February 14th. See Mr. Beaver in room C121 with any questions. Attention juniors, if you're taking the SAT in May or June, you can sign up for the SAT prep course. This is for juniors only and the fee is $30. Seating is limited. Please see Mrs. Scarlatti in the guidance office. Ah, Mrs. Scarlatti. I love her. Um, AP students are registered to take AP exams. AP exam fees are due to Ms. Scarletti, also in guidance office, by Friday, February 7th. So like three weeks, four weeks, three weeks. Yeah. Attention skiers and snowboarders. The paperwork is out for the Vermont trip, which is March 6th to 8th to Stratton, Vermont. The $250 deposit is due by January 21st. Okay. I'm going to go right to the camera for this one. Might want to hit the focus button. Let's see. Wait. It should be here. Oh, wait. I can't focus. All right. Skiers and snowboarders, you saw that announcement. We need more people for Vermont. It's been like a memorial thing. There's like four Liberty kids and like 25 Liberty, uh, yeah, 25 Memorial kids and like four Liberty kids every year. Come out, ski club, Vermont, good trip. Overnight, it's a good time. All right. I felt like it'd be more impactful if I like, you know, I couldn't grab the camera like they do in movies because I would've been out of focus, so right. I walked up to it. I don't know if that worked or not, but all right, moving on. There will be a meeting for all current members of the Mu Alpha Theta. I feel very Greek today. This is like my second announcement where I'm talking about things in Greek. Um, uh, interested in applying for membership for Mu Theta Alpha on Wednesday, January 22nd in B225, immediately after school. Please see Ms. Coyle for additional information. Applications for membership can be picked up in room B225 or accessed online on Mrs. Coyle's page on the Liberty website. Look for the Mu Alpha Theta tab. The Jackson Liberty Football Bowling Banquet will be held this Saturday, January 18th from 4 to 7 at Howell Lane. See Coach Sharples for details. You know, I heard that Justin Bone goes crazy at those things. He does like some windmill dance thing okay. that's like insane. So that, that, I heard they're off the hook. That's the best banquet there is. Um, all right, now for the SAT word of the day, it is tenacious, which means tough and stubborn. Yep, now let's check in with today's weather. Uh, today will be sunny with a high of 32 and a low of 18. There will be some snow tonight and tomorrow with up to an inch possible. High tomorrow of 37 and a low of 36. Sunday will be windy with a high of 39 and a low of 22. And Monday, MLK uh, Junior Day, will be sunny with a high of 34 and a low of 19. MLK Junior Day. I'm sorry, Amber's yelling something to me offset. What's that, Amber? The, oh, oh yeah. Okay. This sounds like a joke, but amazingly, it is not. Um, JTV is looking for someone in the building that owns a pet snake for a shoot that we have to do involving a snake. I know, I know, keep it clean. Um, if anyone owns a snake and would be willing to volunteer your time and the snake's time to uh, shoot in a video with us, please come down to D105 uh, and let us know. Um, yeah, further information will be supplied when you come down to the TV studio um, or give us a call or email us, either way. All right, uh, day, in, day in history, that's you. Oh, by uh, the way, just really quick from the last thing, okay. Monday, just a reminder, we're off. No school, Monday, we're off. Yesterday mm -hmm. I said that and when people went, what, we're off from school? Yes, we are off from school. Yes, and now it's time for this day in history. On January 17th, 1950, 11 men steal more than $2 million, $29 million today, from the Brinks Armored Car uh, Depot in Boston, Massachusetts. It was the perfect crime, almost, as the culprits weren't caught until January 1956, just days before the Statue of Limitations for the theft expired. 
Bet that was a really fun five years for those guys, though. I guess $29 million in today's equivalents. Imagine that five years, 20, I could spend $29 million in five years. No problem. Be fun. All right, yeah. that's all we have for today. Have a great day, Liberty. Bye, guys. Have a good long weekend.